It was Wednesday evening. I was sipping my coffee and enjoying my EST journey in focus when someone asked how to install Loda in focus. My friend, you have been heard. Then I realized I was so engrossed in the beauty and ease of use of focus, I actually forgot to try out any of the Lodas that I possess. So I started my journey to see how we can install Loda models in focus. Is it really easy to use them? And do they really perform just like other OBIs? Let's find out. If you have watched some of my previous videos, you already know how this is gonna turn out. We are going to pay a visit to our favorite store where everything is free. CVTI.com Let's filter the model specifically for SDXL Loda models. I think today I am going to try out this Ulify SDXL and this Cimatix SDXL model. Just download them from this link here. The next is a simple game of copy and paste. Go to Focus Models, Loaders and bring our Loda models here. Now I am going to restart the Focus OBY. Next we click on this advanced checkbox here and under the model tab we can see you can select 5 Loda models and apply them simultaneously. From this drop down menu I can select any Loda models I want. For starters I am going to start with none. Here is an option to select the model weight which varies from minus 2 to plus 2 and generally is kept at 0.5. That answers our first question. Can you install Loda models in Focus EBY? You definitely can. Is it easy to use? This is the easiest way I have ever used any Libra models. Even in automatic 11.11 it is not this much easy to use and don't make me start on comfy UI. Here you can just select the Loda model and adjust the slider to select the model strength. That's fabulous. Now let us first generate an image without selecting any Loda models with a fixed seed. I am going to put 899 there just random and for the schematics model we have to use this prompt for the Loda to take effect. I am going to copy this paste it and change the concept with beautiful woman rainbow hairs green eyes and generate our first image and this is how it looks without any Loda model applied. Now let's go to model and select the schematics Loda model. Generate. The image has certainly changed but not ch changed as much as we wanted. Let's try increasing the weight of the Loda model. Even at 1.05 model weight this hasn't changed the image it should with the Loda model. Let's try increasing it a little bit more. Now with the model weight amped up to 1.31 this really lo is looking like the Loda model. So that answers our final question. Loda models work in focus exactly like they work in automatic 11.11 or comfy UI. Let us try the second Loda model that we downloaded. Here the trigger word is Ulen with double O's replaced by zeros. I am just going to put the trigger word in front of the prompt and again set the Loda to none. This looks a lot like the first image. Actually the styles in Focus applies lot of prompts on top of our original prompts into the image. Therefore the generated image is almost the same as the first one because major part of the prompt is still the same and the seed is same. Now let us select the Ulify Loda model and I am going to keep it 1.31 from the get go this time but the image still looks the same. Let's try setting the model to maximum. The image has changed but it still looks nothing like the Loda model. Maybe in this case the Loda model works based with other types of prompts, other types of inanimate objects. Let's try one prompt from the CVTI page. I'll just be copy pasting the positive and negative prompts from their page and generate the image. And this time this worked perfectly. Maybe it has to do something which kind of prompts are applicable with this Loda. Let me try the same prompt again without the Loda model applied. This one also looks made of wools just like the previous image and without the Loda model applied. Clearly it is in the prompts that this image turned out this way not the other way around and the previous image where I didn't use specific prompts it could not employ the Loda model onto the image. Well it was really fun today if you want me to keep making these kinds of videos then a thumbs up and a th subscribe would be very much helpful for this channel. Comment below the next topic you want me to make videos about and if you are more of a fan of automatic 11.11 or comfy UI compared to Focus, then go watch these two videos to learn how you can install Loda models in automatic 11.11 and comfy UI. See you on our next video.